What's up everyone? Welcome back to my channel. If you guys have been following me and Dan's vlogs, which I think you should, we daily vlog, so if you haven't checked that out, make sure to go do it. You'll know that I've spent so many days back to back at my cousin Sophia's pool. She just has like the best backyard pool ever and for summertime it's just like I'm always there because why not, right? And so I've been getting a lot of questions for those of you that watch that channel about what I like wear to the pool, what kind of makeup I like to wear, especially if it's like for a specific pool party. And I know a lot of you guys have pool parties coming up because I've been getting so many questions on Instagram and stuff about it. You know, I thought like what would I wear if I was going to a pool party which, you know, <laughs> not go in, but if I was, what would I wear? I thought I would make a video all catered towards that, minimalistic makeup, but also like waterproof, uh, sun protected, and all that kind of stuff. I also show you a lip option, so there's like, you know, two different ones if you don't want to go as intense. And then of course, hair and an outfit and a bikini. So if you are curious to see how I would get ready for a pool party or a beach party, it doesn't have to be strictly towards a pool. And I mean, if you wanted to wear this, on any day you could as well because it's sweat proof so that's great just keep on watching and also if you're new to this channel don't forget to subscribe so starting off with my face as you could tell does not match the rest of my skin I make sure to always apply a sunscreen this one is from Sephora it's SPF 50 but I just really need to make sure that my skin is prepped for the Sun then using a tinted moisturizer, I am just going to be applying this. As you can see, it's a little bit darker than my skin, but it somewhat matches the rest of my body. I could have gone a bit darker, to be honest, but I really like tinted moisturizers because they're not heavy, plus they just act as a moisturizer, so my skin is technically... not technically. It's usually very dry, so this works well, especially above the sunscreen. It doesn't get cakey or anything like that, and it's lightweight. feels great. Then going in with some concealer. This is from NARS and I just use the tiniest amount underneath my eyes and blend that in to hide any bags or anything like that. Moving on to the eyebrows. You guys, this is obviously not mandatory. All of this is not mandatory, but for me personally, because I don't really have eyebrows, if I'm going to some kind of an event, a pool party, a beach party, any kind of thing, you know, I, I wanna have some eyebrows. So I'm just going to be filling those in and then using my Gimme Brow by Benefit to add a little bit more volume to them. And this also makes sure that they don't like move throughout the day. Then using some bronzer, I'm going to be applying this all over my face just because the actual tinted moisturizer didn't really match the rest of my body. So um, if yours does, you can totally skip the bronzer part, but you know. If it doesn't, this just helps. Also, it does help to get rid of any shine, so that's good. But I am going to want to use some highlight on like the high points of my face. So this is Champagne Pop by Becca Cosmetics. It's literally the best thing ever. Everyone raves about it, so I got it, and it really is the best thing. going in with my eyes I like to use a like eyeshadow base like a cream as just my all-over lid color this just makes sure it doesn't like run all day if you're sweating and stuff and then of course a waterproof mascara in case you do go in the pool get wet whatever you're sweating you won't have that like disgusting mascara running down your face because that used to happen to me a lot in swimming always actually because I thought it was cool and wore makeup to swimming Then going in with some CoverGirl Matte Lip Balm slash Lipstick. This is a really nice subtle shade, but if you want to go a bit darker, I would use a liquid lipstick. This is just by the Kylie Lip Kit um, in, I think this is Dolce K, but you can totally wear any other you know liquid lipstick. The reason why I like them is because they um, go matte and they don't budge. So that's another thing. Something that like will not budge when you go in the water. And this is perfect. I wear this all day and like it seriously does not budge. Then going on to the hair, um, I have not washed my hair in four days when I filmed this so as you can see it's super greasy. 
but don't worry guys, I got all the tricks to not, um, you know, wash my hair because I'm lazy. So going with some extensions, I love to use these for especially like beach parties and pool parties just because I feel like a mermaid. But what I love to do is braid them in really thick braids. So I just separate my hair in two and then each side I braid them crossing over each other. And then when I'm around like three quarters of the way down, I secure it with a clear elastic and then I pull out the pieces a ton to make them super thick and super... Um, like luscious and just looking real bohemian and like mermaid-esque. I love these a ton and I make sure to keep out some pieces around my face. Once they're both done, what I do is add a hat because, you know, greasy hair is gross. And yeah, this is the finished look. I think it's so cute. As for the outfit, I like to wear tank tops because it gets really hot and then shorts as well. For a bathing suit, what I really like to wear is like obviously a triangle bathing suit because if I am going to tan my top, I like to have that tan. And then the bottom, something a bit more high-waisted if you are uncomfortable being in like, you know, a thong with, around a bunch of people. This is just my favorite thing to wear. I think it's so cute. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to give it a big thumbs up because it makes me super happy. Also, I know so many of you want to know when my like updated bikini collection video is coming up. That's coming up soon. I'm in Iceland at the moment, or I was in Iceland. I don't know. I'm pre-filming this video, so I have to wait till I'm back from that to be able to film it. And I also needed like my cousin's pool to be able to film it. Um, and I had. I don't have that much time. Plus, I have bikinis coming in the mail. So don't worry, it's coming very soon, this week or the next one. It's coming. I love you guys all so much. Seriously, you don't know how much you guys mean to me. Make me so happy, and I hope I can make you guys happy. I love you, and I'll see you all in my next video. Bye!